One more time now, y'all. One hop this time. We're not starting this way. We're not starting this way. <laughs> Guess we are. Welcome back to No Effort. I'm Eclipse again. What's up, my friends? I've got a biomanalyzer about to make it today. We have a fucking... Uh, I'm stopping. I'm just uh, cut, cut, cut. Salutations. My name is Eclipse again, and welcome back to no fucking effort. Zero effort given, zero fucks given, and zero balls ridden. Welcome to the final episode of this week. I know, sad, but it's Friday, and today we are going to get Nether Amethyst, which I've done a little bit of research, and by that I mean I asked my Discord. Pfft, you should join that, by the way. <laughs> Link in the description. I asked my Discord, and they told me that Nether Amethyst is found anywhere between. Between Y108 and Y10. And it can only be found in the hell biome, which is why we made that biomalyzer. If you look at the top left, we can now see what biome we're in. We're in the Badlands. We're gonna go to hell and go find that fucking amethyst because I am sick and tired of not having things organized. And the only way to get proper and gooder organization starting from here on in is storage drawers. Look, if you know me, you'll know I fucking hate storage drawers, but we do not have a choice. So here we are. We're in hell. Let's look for some nether amethyst. It can spawn anywhere, and it doesn't even have to be mined. I'm gonna mine it anyway, though, because this seems like the safest way to look for stuff. So this is gonna be today's episode. I wanna find nine of it. Whenever we find it, we wanna fortune that shit. I got fortune two here, and I got fortune two here. I, I don't know which one's better. I'm gonna assume we're gonna just use uh, the maze breaker. That's probably gonna be the safest bet. If we break into uh, like caves and stuff, that's also gonna be a nice place to find it. We're on Y level 69, cause the, uh, the world's really funny like that. Of oh, fucking course we are. <laughs> Well, I'm gonna stay on Y level 69 and see if we can find some amethyst. I've heard it's really rare, but we just need to find nine and it's fortunable. So let's do this. Oh, okay. This is my last episode to record before, ooh, Ruthless Sand. See, we gotta turn. We gotta turn, that ain't right. This is my last episode to record, though, before uh, we continue, um, or before, like, I have, like, everything done this week. So that's really sick. Um, I wonder, hold on, let me see. Did that help? Would this help finding it? Who knows? I mean, I might be wasting a lot of obsidian doing it. What do you mean advanced? I, what? This is not the first time I've ate Hydra Chop. Not even close. Um, but what I was saying before is that uh, this is my last episode to record and then I am done recording for the day and then I'm just going to edit it all so it's all ready for you guys. I got all my work done and we're gonna plan out to tomorrow. Well, next week's work because I like to be all efficient and shit. And it's gonna be nice. So yeah, um, I'm just gonna chat with you guys. Just hang out a bit, uh, talk to you all while I'm mining. We're gonna be looking for amethyst and as soon as I can find my first one, I'll know it's possible. Uh, I did mine. Wow. Wow. Oh my God, what? What? I promise this is not pre-recorded. I pro- I, what the fuck? What the fuck? How did I do that? How did I just do that? Oh my god. Oh my god, that was sick. I'm cool. I'm fucking cool. Oh my god. Well, we got two. We've got seven more to find, and I am heading back to uh, base real quick to get me some uh, obsidian to repair my pickaxe just over and over and over again. And this is gonna help upgrade its XP because this is gonna be our main pickaxe. We're gonna upgrade it whenever we get out of this age. Um, yeah, so that's gonna be nice. That's gonna be good. We're ready for everything. You now know the gist. Hit the like and the subscribe and fuck you. <laughs> I'm kidding, you're awesome. You're fantastic. Dude, the support on No Effort recently has been absolutely incredible. Last week alone pulled more views on No Effort than the channel has ever had for the, for the, uh, for the videos in its entire lifespan. By the way, did you know that Eclipse Again, the channel that you're on right now, has turned a year old recently? I didn't know that until like someone brought it up last night on a live stream. I was like, whoa, you're right. It is a, it is a year old. That's kind of sick. So yeah, no, that's just, I think that's pretty cool. Um, I can't wait. I, I fucking cannot wait to be done 
with this shit to make this thing so I can organize. You don't know how excited I am to be able, I don't even care that it's storage drawers. I'm like not even that miffed anymore. I just need to have organization because my God, I don't. And it's driving me insane. I'm going to end up doing something I will regret. I, I'm going to end up doing regretful actions should I not get uh, fucking shit, you know? Damn. <laughs> My entire brain just just gave up. I've been recording for the past three hours, and my my brain's like, yeah, you know what? I can't do it anymore. I'm I'm out. I'm clocking out, boys. Sorry, we're done. <laughs> oh man, oh man. But it's cool. It's cool. We're almost done recording. I'm so thrilled about that. I got to go do my workout after that. After this, I'm not thrilled about that. But I know I can do it. And once I'm done with that, I'm pretty much done for the day. This is this is how my Sundays go. I don't really get a full Sunday off from uh, working. I, I never get any time off. I'm a fucking YouTube content creator. You're always working. It's just every second of your life is work. Lol. <laughs> but it's really fun work. I mean, come on. I'm playing SevTech. You, you guys know how much I love SevTech. I actually genuinely was like kind of getting bored of SevTech until we reached age three and I am completely revitalized. I am so thrilled to play this every time that I go to record. I'm, mm, I just, I love it so much. Can I do this? I got a plan. I got a plan. It requires going back, but that's okay. It's not a big deal, but I have a plan. I have a plan. I have a plan, I have a plan, I have a plan. I hate that that fucking death bar keeps appearing. This is uh, the thumbnail world that um, I talked about way, way back when. So until we get journey map and I can delete that thing from appearing, it's gonna keep just glitching into existence and glitching out of existence. So that's really nice. Oh man, speaking of death, I, uh, I hate that we don't have the life charm anymore. I mean, I'm glad we had it because it saved my life, but my God, <laughs> like I am not excited. Uh, for, I, well, I'm not, I'm not excited that I lost it, but I, I really need to go get another one. I might actually go do that um, in one of these next couple episodes while we're waiting on like something to smelt or whatever. I might go look for another life charm or like multiple because if I have like four on me, I'll feel a lot better about possibly losing the Sev Tech world because we're kind of, you know, we're, 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 kind, we're kind of just being a Billy Badass right now and just making sure we don't fuck up. That's like, I, I'm, I, it's, I'm playing risky. I'm playing risky is, is what I'm trying to say here. Goddamn. After a couple hours, my brain's just like, I can't say words properly anymore, man. I don't know what you want from me. <laughs> oh, man. Also, I uh, just wanted to take a moment to appreciate all of your comments that you guys have been leaving about no effort. I'm glad that it uh, makes an impact on your day and that you guys really enjoy it. That means a lot to me. And I appreciate all the help because I think that's the only reason I've been getting through H3 as smoothly as I have been. One, the... Uh, actually, there's two reasons. There's two reasons. One is... The book is a lot more descriptive this time around. There's three reasons. One, the book is a lot more descriptive this time around. It leaves a little, like, like very little up to the interpretation. I know exactly how to follow the path. I got it. It's helpful. Uh, two, I know a bit of immersive engineering. Just a, just a teensy-weensy bit. And three, you guys have helped a fuck ton. And honestly, I really appreciate it because I don't want to be on episode 94 and still in age three. Like, like let's not. I'd like to, you know, make some, make some, good, uh, make some good progress here. So here's what I'm thinking. Here's what I'm thinking now that I have rambled enough that we are back home. We have a tool, or I guess home is hell now. We are back in hell. I'm just gonna do that to fix my pickaxe. And then I'm gonna pick this up like it's a shulker box and just walk around like an, like an idiot. But level 69 is gonna be the lucky number. I'm sure of it. Let's go find the rest of that nether amethyst. We found two already. We need nine. So that is seven more to locate. Hell yeah. Chad, it is 63 degrees Fahrenheit outside today, and that is just upsetting. It is it is a hot, hot day. Oh, man. I, I can't believe I'm saying that's hot. I used to live in Texas where that was like fucking nothing. But guess what? I've changed. I like the cold a lot more now. Um, at least that's what I dress for, and that's what I'm like used to. But <laughs> I'm, I'm, it's not that today. It's fucking hot as balls today, and I hate it. Wow, that just mined a fuck ton, and I wonder why. I think excavate 
works based off of hunger? No? I'm so confused. We have a lot of netherrack, though. All right. We have a lot of netherrack. I think I'm probably going to use the maze breaker to find all the amethyst, sadly. I mean, it, it just mines faster. Um, and this, this method doesn't seem to be helping much. Ooh. We've got exposed shit. Hold on. Exposed air is probably the best place that we can find amethyst just poking out. So, good place to start a looking, honestly. And we can only find it in the hell biome, which if you check the biomalyzer, that's exactly where we are. We are in hell. I am on fire. That flower sets me on fire. Good to know. Good to know. Another reason why I'll have to go back to the Ice Queen biome, uh, this bow is breaking. This bow, it is it is running out of durability quick. And I've killed 69 enemies. What's with this 69 today? 69 is showing up in a lot of shit. I love it. What is that thing? Did that flower just shoot fireballs at me? Is that what I just saw? It's like nether sheep. That looks like a nether sheep. Oh no, it's it's a lava guy. Okay, he's just aggro on me. We're just gonna mine over here. Every bit of glowstone I find, I'm picking up because redstone alloy is gonna be expensive. It's gonna really start getting up there in terms of price. And we've got a guy to kill. Okay. They're not too difficult to knock out, which is a good thing. Uh, I don't need all of this netherrack, unless we can compress it. We can make pretty stone out of it, pretty redstone. Well, not redstone, but you, you get the gist. All right, uh, let's keep going this way. Keep going just into hell. And clearly this seems to be the best route to find uh, nether amethyst. Just gonna do with this. Can I, I can get quartz. What does quartz do? Cause I've never picked up quartz before. It makes a hopper, it makes an observer, makes a daylight sensor. It makes all the normal redstone stuff that it usually does. It makes a probe connector or extractor from Steve Carts. Seems to do a lot of stuff from Visecraft. Laboratory block. I want that. And it's chiselable. Oh, it. Ooh! How come no one told me I can make a. Actually, I do remember a comment telling me I can make a player launcher. We have just developed movement, and I didn't even know about it. Oh, well, that's happening soon. Let me get some fucking quartz. Yes, please. Holy shit. Dude, Sevtech's finally starting to pick up in terms of speed. Oh, literally. That's great. I'm so happy about that. All right, just just make me happier by helping me, by letting me find Amethyst. I really hate this stuff that grows on the top of Netherrack. It's really, really annoying. All right, that's not hell anymore. All right, so let's just get a looking. God, it's hot in this room. Is it my PC that's just boiling? It is not. PC is doing fine. Good job, PC. It's just hot in this room. 63 degrees Fahrenheit and about a billion degrees in this office. Great. <laughs> Okay, we're at the peak of the day. It'll get colder, I'm sure. God, it I get like claustrophobic with, with that fucking shit in my face, and I want to just mine like this to find everything. It's not like the best move to mine this way and do this, but I, I just want to. What is that? It's a type of salt? Fire salt. It's used to make rice dough. It's used in the mixer to make dough. It's used, it just makes, it's just salt. It's it's literally just salt that just looks prettier than usual. Okay, great. I'll take it, I guess. I 
I get what I want, don't need no genie. I'm going up. I feel up is better. I, I don't know why. I think they just spawn the same amount, but I want to go to Y69 because funny sex number. So we're going here. Oh. Well, we're in the hell biome, so let's look around a bit. See if we can spot some exposed uh, amethyst. It looks like really fucking... Like, it blends in, is what I'm trying to say. It blends in, like, incredibly well with the rest of the netherrack, and I don't I don't think that's helpful. From what I've seen, uh, from where I've, you know... Oh, hey! There's one. All right, nice. Oh, that was only one. Fuck. Okay, well, six more. Six more. Progress is progress. This is This is what we're doing today, so... I can't be mad about it. But from what I've seen about being in the nether, it seems like this place isn't too dangerous or at least just the normal biomes aren't too dangerous i'm sure it's got dangerous places i don't really want to go into a fortress yet or anything of the such but it seems that running around like a chicken with the dick cut off uh isn't going to be that big of a problem so this might be the best way to find amethyst currently we have three really wish that was like seven but i mean with fortune two what do you expect Oh, I'm on fire. Okay. So that sets you on fire. We don't want that. We don't want to go to the soul sand biome whatsoever. I really don't want to be up here. Yeah, that's better. Down here is better. Okay. Lots of things can spawn in those other biomes. Uh, these lava guys don't seem too big of a problem anymore. I remember one nearly killed me in my first ever uh, Sevtech 100 days attempt. Let me move the mic. Sorry that the mic uh, stands a little squeaky. I find that there's nothing I can do about that. It just kind of gets that way from time to time. Maybe I'll try and fix it. I don't know what I could do. Um, still a looking. For how rare I've been told it is, it's pretty nice that we found th four. God fucking damn it. Unlucky. This fortune is not helping out. Is fortune or luck better, chat? Oh my god. Okay, well, I have luck. Six. Okay, good. Six. We just are missing two. We can't go into that biome. That biome doesn't have it. Big spider. We're gonna go around this way to not piss it off. I really don't want to kill that spider because it poops out babies of doom. I'm not really, not really into that. That's not, that's not what I'm a fan of. All right. Um, oh, shit. Okay, whoever said this took this was really difficult to find. Either I'm incredibly lucky or this is incredibly easy. Nine. Got him. All right. Bingo bongo. Can I do anything else with it? Should I stay here to get any more? Nah. 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 What does this thing do? Resplendent prism. I wish I could know what things do. I don't know. Uh, yeah, no, we're gonna leave. We got nine. That's good enough for me. That is good enough for me. Uh, see, that only took a couple minutes. That wasn't that bad. I really thought that would take longer. Hmm. Super useful. All right, well, let's go back and... Okay. Okay. Let's run back home before I, you know, count my chickens before they hatch. Make sure I don't end up dying. Okay, I'm on fire now. Ow. Running out of hydros, uh, hydro chops. It's not great. Oh, shit, it's up there. Fuck. I'm not really at ease being in the nether. I mean, I don't think you're supposed to be, but I'm really not at ease being in the nether. So I'm glad that we are leaving. But that was not that hard. 20 minutes, nine fucking amethyst. Easy. Easy clap. That was, that was fucking not even rare. I won't go this year. I need more enemies. All that smithereens. <sighs> I get what I want. Don't need no genie. This right here, a toucan, ain't no beanie. Every time they see me, now they froze. Rest in peace to Feeny. Got my own Topanga at the show. Hey. 
All right, we're back on home. I love looking at the EQ logo in, in the ground from afar. That looks really nice. All right, let's put... I actually had an idea. Oh, it makes more stuff. It makes these bricks. What does this brick look like? You know, that looks kind of cool. I might incorporate netherrack in, or nether rot specifically, into our base. Might be, it might be a, a neat thing to put in in the future. For now though, let us start the process of making, well, we can make an amethyst block. So that is step one complete. Boop. And we now need to make the drawer controller. We have birch trim. We need another piece of star metal. Can we make star metal easier? One stardust makes star metal. And a starlight transmutation lens. We can transmutate that uh, iron ore into that. But we to make iron ore, we need materialization. So that's a problem. This seems to be the only way besides making an arc furnace. Arc furnace is expensive. Yeah, arc furnace. Let's look at the engineer's manual and see how hard it is to make an arc furnace. Because to make the, 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 the fucking storage drawers, we need an arc furnace. To make pretty much everything super easy in the future, we need an arc furnace. Like, an arc furnace is probably one of the most important things that we're going to be building. Do I have an engineer's manual? Like, just do any of them. Do I? Please. Thank you. How do I make an arc furnace? Uh, construction. Nope. Simple machines. Heavy machines. Arc furnace. Oh. No. That's a lot of things. Oh, that's a lot of things. Oh, it's still going. Whoever told this man to keep building shit needs to chill. Oh, can we even build that yet? I saw some of those blocks. I, are we, are they unlocked to us yet? This stuff, light engineering block. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, it is. It is all unlocked to us. Scaffolding. That's not too hard. Hmm. Huh. Arc furnace, huh? And it's just one of these, which I know that. Ooh, I don't think we can use it yet. Graphite electrodes. Arc furnace electrodes. Oh, we can? We can, we can. It is this one. We just need hop graphite dust, meaning we need a crusher first. Mm. Either that, either that, or we just go through the process of making a, st uh, a star metal ingot again. I think I'm gonna do the former. Son of a bitch. Rest in peace to Feeny. Got my own Topanga at the show. I just looked up what Topanga means. Got one go this year, I need more enemies. I get what I want, don't need no genie. All right. There's Stardust. So we gotta make a star metal ore. We can't make iron ore yet because I don't have materialization. We need to make nocturnal power. We need to, or powder. We need to make, oh, uh, all of this. <sighs> Fuck. Damn it. All right. Here we go. Yeah. I get what I want, don't need no genie. Why the fuck is my microphone peaking? Every time they see me, not it froze. 
All right, I'm I'm unmuting. I don't care. There's a Jerry and a Will in this call now, and you guys are going to deal with them because I've got a lot of shit to do. So uh, welcome to the podcast, Jerry. <laughs> Will, welcome to the podcast of EQ has to make another star metal ingot. Fuck me. Yay. Hello, how is everyone? I'm dying inside. All right, crushed black quartz. Jerry, are you going live tonight? Mm -hmm. Uh, what are you going live with? Stardew Valley. Oh shit, hell yeah. Alright. Gonna get us some flowers. It's gonna be nice. Oh, I don't wanna do this. I was probably gonna just chill and call, uh, and like, edit while you do stuff. Ooh, doggy! Ooh, speed boots! I want them! Speed boots! Oh, three doggies! Speed boots! Speed boots! Speed boots! Speed boots! Give up! So speed boots. Oh, speed boots out the balls! Yes! Balls. Thank you, Sevtech gods, for spotting not one, not two, but three of those fuckers. <sighs> Amazing. We can make boots again. I ain't doing that right now, though. We're making star metal. Are you fucking my asshole raw at 7 p.m. Central Standard Time? I need two coal and I have none? None! Because I stuck them in here and I made coal coke! Well, my schedule's pretty packed at 7 a.m. Shut seven. up, Will! <laughs> <laughs> I get what I want, don't need no genie. This shit is a two kid, ain't no beanie. Hey, look at that! Guess what I'm coming back to? My old favorite. Wait till the sun goes down. Or else you don't get to craft. <laughs> what a great game mechanic. People talk about loving Astral Sorcery, and then Astral Sorcery does this. Like, how can you love this? Alright, Illumination Powder will happen in approximately 20 years. I don't have the resin- Ah, oh, son of a bitch. We need that player launcher, and we need it yesterday. I'm making that next, next time I get a chance, I swear. All I need is congealed blood. That's not that hard to get. All right, there's that. Check. Uh, next up is not black quartz. It's powder. Gunpowder. Coal. I don't remember the last piece. Son of a bitch. Oh, lapis. Okay. What? What? Why did that not work? Oh, it's illumination powder. I'm stupid. All right. And it is boink, 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 boink. Video killed the radio star. It won't let me put in the stuff automatically. I have to do it manually. That's so annoying. No. No, I'm one black dye powder short. Are you shitting me? Come on, fuck Astral Sorcery, dude. Fuck this mod in its fucking ass. It's the shittiest mod. No one likes it. It's not good. It's bad. And I will fucking fight anyone that says otherwise. Damn it. Hate this mod. I 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 hate this mod. Ah! Fuck Zeptek. If the sun goes up, I swear to God, I will chuck an orphan through 15 football fields. I will steal Jerry's motive and mantra. I will, I will do it. I will fucking do it. I, I swear to God, don't you dare let the, don't you dare let the sun go up. We got half a moon left. We better, that better be all we fucking need. You hear me? You hear me, Sky? You hear me, Astral bitches? I'm fucking Grandma pissed. will not be at Christmas. I will fight the stars. <laughs> Fuck piss, dude. I, I genuinely loathe Astral Sorcery. 
Oh, run it over here, and we're going over here, and we're gonna break our bones, but that's okay. Run it over here, and we're gonna click on this, and we're gonna get black dye powder anyway. Gonna do this, and we're gonna black lotus in, and we're gonna wait for it to make powder, because I need four in order to do this, and I don't have a lot of time left. I need to get me some star metal so I can melt it down and make a motherfucking controller for my storage drawer, so eventually I can have more storage in my happiness in my life, so I can organize and have everything go my way, but I I don't have that fucking luxury because all the fucking moon is descending. This is not good. Hopefully, I can get there before it turns daytime. Fuck everything. Septic sucks and astral sorcery can kiss my ass. Troll. I'll be here all week. <laughs> uh, run. Run faster than the moon. Run faster than the damn moon. Go. Go. I think, we, I think we made it. I think we made it with plenty of time, because this is a pretty simple um, spell, so it doesn't need to be complete midnight in order for it to work like some other things. Black dye powder, like so. Pardon? Pardon? What did I do wrong? Is it not black dye powder? Am I stupid? It's nocturnal powder. I'm dumb as rocks. I don't have nocturnal powder. Didn't I make that? Son of a bitch. Oh, I didn't pick it up. It's right there. Oh, 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 God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Quickly, 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 quickly. I bet everyone in the comments is screaming at me. I bet everyone is just, like, losing their shit. That's fine. That's okay. I get it. I'm st- Pardon? Illumination powder. Check, check, check. Yep, mm-hmm. Yep, mm-hmm. That's good. Yep, mm -hmm. the runestone. It's runestone. You don't know how tempted I am to throw myself off this building and end Sevtech. You don't know how tempted I was to just die. I'm gonna go take a shower because the sun's gotta come down again. I bet you I could do that in the time it would take. I bet you I could. Let me go get not runestone. Okay, in my defense, runestone looks exactly like normal stone, okay? Fuck you. I get what I want, don't need no genie. <laughs> this is not a toque, it's not a beanie. <laughs> I can't believe that, are you shitting me? <laughs> Every time they see me now, they froze. <laughs> this wouldn't happen if I had organization. There's just normal stone in this fucking chest. I'm gonna break my breast. <sighs> there once was a ship that put to sea and EQ did not like this mod. Nothing funny or rhyming about that. It's just the truth. I just don't like this mod. The winds blew up her powder. Down below my billy boys blow uh, Soon may the weller man come To bring us sugar and tea and rum One day when the tongue and is done We'll take our leave and go Ooh, Soon may the weller man come To bring us sugar and tea and rum Bet you there's not enough light in this To make the altar go Nope! I will be right back. I hate my life. The shit is whack. I'm gonna go shower now. Fuck you guys. I'll see you at nighttime. Oh, look, it's nighttime again. Who would have thought? Hey, look, Star Metal. I think I'll make you. Fuck off. You better work. Thank you. <sighs> That's all I'm doing for this part, man. We're smelting this, and I'm done. I'll see you guys Monday, where we do, um, 
Organization! That's a post-workout organization. That shit was powerful. All right, fuck you. I'm done. And I'll see you guys Monday. Sorry, I just got done working out. That's how long it took for it to become nighttime. I was literally able to do a full workout. Fuck you. Good night.